Hi guys, this is Abby Eagle and in this video I'm going to show you how to use the shape tool in Photoshop. So we start with the um, shape tool. Go get the rectangular tool over here and you get a little square, pull it out. Now you can make a rectangle but if you hold down the shift key it'll come back, constrain back into a square. Then you release the um, mouse key, you have a square. So here there's, um, there's no fill but we have a stroke set for five points. Uh, so it looks all right. So you make a square and oh okay let's just make a triangle. I showed this on another one but just do a little triangle. There we go. So we get our square but now we go up here to the uh, pen tool. If you click on one of the corners, you get a node, click, oh, sorry, delete anchor point tool. There we go. Finally got there. Got yourself a triangle. And now let's go back down to here to the rounded rectangular tool. Whoa. And you can see with this one here, the square has rounded corners. Now what you need to do is you need to check the radius before you actually make it because you can't ch change it afterwards. Well, with difficulty. So set your radius up there. And now let's go to the ellipse tool. So you can make an ellipse or you can make a circle, to hold whatever you want for yourself. So let's just make an ellipse this time. Whoops. And maybe this time we'll actually just give it a bit of a fill, just make it a little bit different. There we are, just give it a fill. Okay, okay. Put it out of the way. So what's next? We get to the polygon tool. Now the polygon tool, so, so you've got your menu up here for all these shapes. So sides. So let's say we just give it, say, I don't know, 10 sides. And what I've already done previously. So we go into radius, let me smooth corners, take out smooth corners, take out the star. <laughs> all right. Okay, so right. there we are. So maybe for the moment, let's just back out of this one. Delete the layer, come back to a polygon tool. Let's just make it a little bit, um, smaller by put it there now so you take your polygon tool polygon tool here and let's just I don't know let's give it say 12 sides so we go there let's just give it a um, go back give it a different color and then what we can do we go up here to the um, pen tool delete anchor point now there's going to be nodes on each of those corners and when you click it you can remove some of them to make an odd shape now the other thing which we saw earlier with the uh, polygon tool is this. So we go up here, so you can actually make it into a star, like so. So you can make it into a star. You can also 
smooth off the corners. So you smooth off the corners. And you can also, probably not that one. You can also um, smooth the indents in here. Like so, see? So, smooth it up. Just give it a fill or something or other. I don't know. Um, gray. If I make black, that'll do. And now we go for the line tool. So we can take the line. So up here, the stroke options, line tool. See, there's the weight. This is the weight there, let's make it five pixels and then we'll go into this over here. So you take a line and there you draw it out. At the moment it actually has a stroke, so we don't really need to give it a stroke, but we should give it a fill and let's make it black. How's that? So there's our line. And now if we take that line tool, and now we give it an arrow head. So you can give it an arrow head at one end. And uh, you can give it an arrow head, whoops, arrow head at both ends. And you can change the, um, Change the width, 500%. See the arrowhead gets narrower. If you change the weight, let's go say 40 pixels there. Whoa. What happened there? Let's just get rid of that one. Go back. Get our, let's just make it 10. All right, so you can play around with the arrows and then we've been all the way through, then we get to the custom shape tool. So up here, you get your custom shapes and there's a whole stack of, um, Clip art, which you can actually alter using the pen tool. But just for the moment, what are we going to do? I know, just grab a car. Just grab a car. And here we can just draw it out. We can, whatever you want. So there's a car. You can change the color, of course. Change the fill. Change the fill. Back to good old black. And so the shape tool. And here. There we go. So it's basically it. So now you know how to use the shape tool. Well, the basics. So if you found this uh, video to be of value, please like it and subscribe and let me know what videos you want me to make for you. And remember to challenge everything for the truth. And I'll see you next time.